First turn on the power of the transmitter. Hold down the REV key without letting go, then control the CHE handwheel or CHR any direction. If there is a sound, it means the setting is successful. First turn on the power of the transmitter. Power on the remote control again. Release the REV key at the same time. Enter the adjustment mode of stroke. At this time, the two lights on the panel will flash simultaneously. Press again to add and subtract CHE direction and size setting of stroke. Factory default stroke amount is appropriately reduced. You can add or subtract stroke amount according to your own needs. So is CHR. The default stroke is the largest. The maximum to minimum stroke is divided into levels each time you press one gear. and hold the CH7 and CH4 switches at the same time. Power on the remote control. The mixing indicator on the panel will light up. Indicates that the setting is successful. The mixing control is opened and closed in the same way. Loss of control protection is a protection function for the receiver to lose signal. Avoid loss caused by loss of control. We first need to match the code successfully. Power on the transmitter. At this time, the signal light of the receiver will always be on. Unplug the codec. Control the transmitter's throttle channel. Make the throttle control the mag level governor into the state of braking or stalling. Keep still. Then insert the encoder into the receiver's beam pairing hole. At this time, the LED light will keep flashing. When the light stops flashing and keeps on, it means that the fail-safe function is set. Then we test it. Turn off the transmitter power first. Then check whether the servo of the throttle channel enters the set position. 